Hello guys, welcome back to my channel and for today's video, gagawa tayo ng ating Japan haul. So this is the very first chapter and this is the first and not the final chapter of our Japan haul kasi may part 2 pa tayo ng Japan haul yun yung with collaboration of you with YouTuber Andy Andres pero ang pinagkaiba lang nila ay yung mga pinamili ko dito ay not categorized unlike yung kay YouTuber Ate Andy Andres so um let without further ado let us get started so here is what my sister got from Mikatsuki Momoko just for your information pala nakalimot ko talaga sabihin to guys is si Ate yung pumunta sa Japan hindi ako kasama hindi kasama yung buong family siya lang talaga pumunta so I wanna know if what what she got from me for me, what she got for my family and stuff like that. So get let going back to the Mikatsuki Momoko store. So this is the whole receipt from Mikatsuki Momoko. So I know she bought this in Osaka. So this is a 300 yen store. It's somewhat similar to Daiso, but much fashionista like or much a little bit. Pero sabi ni Ate mas odin may kaartehan daw. So she. According to the receipt, since I could read Japanese, um, so if you want, so if everything I buy here, I will translate it in English. So if in case you're asking me, what did I buy, I will be translating them into English because I do understand Japanese. So here, according to the receipt again, my sister got a jewelry holder for only 300 yen, thanks to the another 150 yen discount. So she had to pay a total of. 486 yen including tax because of Japan's 8% tax in every purchases. So my sister gave, gave a change of my sister gave 1,000 yen to the clerk and got 514 yen back. So this is how it looks like guys and it's super cute or what in Japanese you can call mecha kawaii. Like, kore wo miti kudasai. It's so cute. Mecha kawaii desu yo ne. Oh my god, why am I speaking Japanese in my video? So that is what my sister got from Mikaru from Mikatsuki Momoko. So here is what she got from I don't know what store is it because I repeat. Since my sister was the one who made Empake, she was she might have mixed up her stuff. So here I've got two two power banks. These are only both in 2000 milliamps. So these are both designed for cell phones and they're just for that. So my sister got these two for only 500 yen each. She got it in the black and white variant. Although I don't know where she got it but I think she got it in Akihabara. Although I don't know where in Akihabara particularly. So here is some ramen. Something that they put in the ramen. It's like similar to the Philippines. Parang tenga ng daga thingy. It looks like that. And my sister got this from 7-Eleven. Although I think this is only 200 yen. Kasi feeling ko ganun yung mga presyo sa 7-Eleven sa Japan guys. Here they have... Oh, I think this is my sister, where my sister put some kuro tamago or in English what they call black egg. So this is like where my sister put her kuro tamago which means black egg. So this is everything about the kuro tamago here. I could really confirm that my sister mixed up the plastics because she like put everything in this ABC Mart plastic and I know that ABC Mart in Japan is where a place because I know that ABC Mart in Japan is where a place you buy your shoes and not food, okay? So here I'm in this very big wait, 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 sorry. So here is what you call the ramen or this is ramen, okay? So this is like ramen, instant ramen, but the much but the much authentic version. So I think this is like a, the five meal pack as stated here. Since I repeat, I said I could read Japanese. So here it says five packs or, or five packs of for five meals. So here are like the instructions, and they're all Japanese. So. Since it's Japanese, I could read it a little because you know I read Japanese. 
here in the back, I don't know how to read this because it has a lot of kanji and I know, you know that I don't really read kanji that much. So I can't really describe its name in Japanese. Although I know about its allergen information, so if in case you're allergic into a lot of things, then this product will not be for you because it because this has allergy concerns in egg, fish, egg, shrimp, orange, sesame, banana, apple, stuff like that. And most of the important kind of allergies such as mackerel, um, pork, soy, and stuff like that. So, if you're allergic to soy or saba or the mackerel, then this will not be for you. So here I've got this cutie melty kiss from Meiji. It's super mecha kawaii from the packaging and this is the white chocolate kind of thingy from Meiji and I know that they you could rarely see this from Meiji here in the Philippines so if in case you're asking me what this is this is the Meiji Melty Kiss Sweet Kiss in the white chocolate variant so I know, hope the camera could be focusing wait I'll try to focus it at its best autofocus I think it's an autofocus so let's go so this is how it looks like I hope you can see it or I wish the camera could pick it up so this is what it looks like guys and this is the Melty Kiss Okay. And you know I love chocolate, so thoughtful my f So I know I love white chocolate, so thoughtful of my sister, thank you very much, Ate. So she gave me that, so arigato gozaimashita. Even though she's not Japanese, I will speak Japanese. Here I have this Meiji Best 3 chocolate. Although, it's already common here in the Philippines because you could get this already in SM supermarket so I wouldn't really find it that petty here in the Philippines so here are just a few hotel souvenirs I know that my sister went to Centurion Hotel thanks to those souvenirs here is another melted kiss for myself arigato gozaimashita to my thankful sister so that is it for this ABC Mart wrapper so here I have a few food as well so since my sister bought me a lot of food talaga so this is the matcha almond chocolate oh my gosh it's so yummy to look at i think i'm starting to become hungry again and i'll become short freaking tempered i don't know where she got this but i think she got it from the supermarket and this is the matcha almond kind of chocolate or confectionery and this is what authentic authentic wagashi is so in the back, I don't know how what is written in it, but it's saying almond blah 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 because it's in full kanji again, so I may not be fully able to comprehend it. So like, that's it. I think this was manufactured in Kumamoto because of the Here I have this toilet seat cover, the O-type. I don't know why my sister bought this for our house. But I believe that this is for our house. So all the instructions here are in Japanese. And my sister got this from the store Kyando. I don't know what store is Kyando, but I think she got it in Tokyo. Here is of course our favorite nuts that we get every time in Daiso. If we go back to the Daiso here in the Philippines, I think this is it. This is it. So I don't know what this is, but I think these are nuts. I'll just look at no, look at it behind it. I think this is the third level of spiciness. I think because of this. See that small text? I think because of that it says that. So at the back it is saying oh small nuts, I think. I think it's saying chestnut. I don't know. I think it's saying cashew at the back. Although I don't know how to say that in Japanese. Here we have another kind of Japanese dried snacks, or that's what we call it. So this is another set of Japanese dried snacks. So wait, I will look for the names. There's no names, unfortunately, but they do have the nutrition facts. 
So this product is like 150 milligrams of freaking soda. Sodium. Last but not the least, another toilet lid cover for what? I believe my sister has been like curious about our house's toilet sanitary issues or something. Somewhat curious with like toilet sanita sanitary sanitary or whatever they call it. So that ends there on this Forever 21 plastic. So let us move on to the last but not the least plastic from Kurochu. I don't know, but I don't know. So here is the Royce chocolate or chocolate high quality good taste. Kind of chocolate that they do have it in here, here in the Philippines, but it's gonna be 350 pesos. So this is the creamy milk variant. It's already written down below and you can get this in the Philippines in case. So this is my favorite flavor ever. Here I've got this Royce Almond inside or Almond Fitted Chocolate here and that's all of it. It's just the same variant as the other one. Here I also have this original flavor or the standard milk flavor, Royce Chocolate High Quality and Good Taste. So this is how it looks like. All of these cost 350 pesos here in the Philippines, but in Japan it will cost a lot cheaper. So I have this macadamia chocolate from Meiji. Here is it because I know I think I saw this before. However, that was just for the almond variant. So since my sister is so thoughtful, she bought this. So here in the back, just simply describe. So, ito yung mga pahabol na items na kinuha ko from Japan. And, tignan na natin sila. So, here is the green tea, tea bags that I've got from Japan. And these are 10 pieces of the ones with matcha powder and 10 pieces without it. I don't know where my sister bought this, but I think she bought it in the Narita Airport of Tokyo or in the Chiba Prefecture. So here, how it here is the looks of it. So if you look, try to look for this in the Narita Airport. Although I'm not confirming whether it's in Narita Airport, make sure to like um, ask if they have this. So because I'm not really sure if they have it in Narita Airport. So look at it and make a screenshot of it para malaman mo or para mapakita mo doon sa clerk. So this is how it looks like. Ipa screenshot na lang siya. So that is the main looks of it and yun yung kanyang look just in case if you want to know saan mabibili so ito na nga So these are I bought two packs of Nozaki's beef Nozaki's corned beef I have a very strong implication that this is important because I think Jap the Japanese don't produce corned beef I'm not sure with that so Correct me if I if I'm wrong, but I think this is important. So I want to try to eat this because I think it's gonna be yummy. Here we have our 7-Eleven um, ramen appetizer. This is how it looks like, okay? And this is parang tengan ng bagat sa ramen. If you don't know what tengan ng bagat is, this is how it looks like. Although I think this is dried mushrooms. Last but we also have Kit Kat here. This is just a normal Kit Kat, but rather the Japanese export of the Kit Kat. So this is how it looks like. It's just a normal Kit Kat you can get in the supermarket or in the convenience stores. So here we have the last item that I've got from the Narita Duty Free Airport, which is the Wait, it's still scotch tape, so I want to remove the scotch tape first. So I think that my sister told me that this is a camera battery, for, or this is a camera for my new battery. For my, camera for my new camera. So let us see how it looks like. My gosh, this is taking forever. Actually, 
actually I was wrong. This is how it looks like. It's a Fuji film, it's a mini monochrome film. So since I have my own Instax, I should also have my film because it wouldn't work without that. So I, my sister got this monochrome film um, for the Instax and she only got it for 880 yen or 300 pesos. And this is the monochrome variant so I could take black and white pictures instead of the colored ones. So this is the 10 sheets of it and behind is just typical film that you can buy everywhere. So last last na last talaga to. So I've got two parang IMOs or these are not literally IMOs actually. Um these are eye drops na pampagising hindi yung pang pa treat ng irritated red eyes ninyo. So this is what it looks like. So, so this is how it looks like. Iba yung mga variants niya. So Hindi nito maintindihan because it's purely Japanese, but I will be translating everything that the card, the, the, the package says. So here it says to like wake up the eyes. So it's the Roto Z. So in, in a moment, I think it will cool up the eyes. And of course, it has English translations and everything. So it says. Wow, what a feeling. Strong yet soft, the indescribable sensation is truly long-lasting. The sensation spreads through my brain. I feel wide awake. My eyes are purified and refreshed. So I think that this is not only the, what you use to like make your eyes look awake, but also this could use to treat your eyes. Here in the back is also purely Japanese translation. So here it says that it has the highest strength in the ano in the in the spiciness or the coolness so it goes up to the highest level or eight which is the strongest according to the box because it says tsuyoi which means strong and not yoi which is weak so here it also has some few vitamins that is good for your eyes it has l r l asuparadin L asparadine, I don't know what kind of vitamins is that. It also has vitamin B6 here inside, so that means it's healthy for the eyes. And it has a lot of more vitamins. So I know that this product has vitamin B6 according to the box, although it is written in Japanese, so you might really not understand that all. Here in the other one, we have this cool black. Uh, moisturizing kasi nakasulat na dito ay moisturizing siya which is uroi which means 40 something and its strength level is up to number 7 and I think yung parang spicy niya is in hot ay wala so here in the back it looks like parang a car deodorant yung packaging niya and the, the coolness level is at the highest daw which is number seven so it also tells you a few specs about your contact lens so that means this could work if with your contact lenses so if you have soft contact lenses if you have hard contact lenses if you have O2 kind of contact lenses and I think um, second use or reusable contact lenses this, this is gonna be for you guys so that is so it also has the same vitamins so it has L asparagine. I don't know what kind of vitamin is that. It's just in the box and it's purely katakana, so I'm not sure of it because sometimes Japanese change the pronunciation of everything. So last but not the least, I have this very cute ball that I think my sister got in Hakone. I don't know where in Hokane did she get this, but it's super cute and she has pictures of it. I will show you a picture of it because it's very good looking so that is all what I've got from Japan so and lastly thank you for watching this video I hope you subscribe to my channel guys because I make interesting videos so this is the Japan haul of mine which is the very first part or the or the part one of it because there will be part two of the Japan haul with in collaboration with youtuber Andy Anges although this the categories that I use for that collaboration with that with that YouTuber is parang fixed 
yung parang collaboration thingy or yung or yung mga binabamili namin ay fixed category so that means sino pwede namin bilhin unlike ito free categories walang, walang requirements so thank you for watching this video I hope you like subscribe and comment because I would appreciate if you do those three things and kung alam niyo na gusto niyo video mag like up na lang kayo kung hindi niyo na gusto kan dislike niyo na lang hindi ko naman kayo pinipilit na gusto hindi hindi ko rin kayo pinipilit panoorin yung aking video so thank you for watching na lang kung ginusto niyo pa rin so bye bye